Yo, what's up, Phoenix? It's your boy, Monty. With Miss Unique Divine. What's up, girl? What's going on? Not much. So, what you been up to since we last time we chit-chatted? Um, right now, I'm just working on um, my album. Actually, I'm, I don't have a name for it yet, but just been putting out a CD, uh, my EP, Divine State of Mind. I've been putting out a lot of free copies of that, different shows, um, you know, just rocking these shows. But right now, I'm just actually focusing on a video that I have uh, called Last Words, directed by Carlos Berber. It's more like a short film. Okay. Um, okay. So it's something that I'm really, uh, you know, it's really personal to me. Uh, you know, it's a big case out here, so I'm really, you know, taking it personal. And I'm also hoping to have that done within, you know, the next month so I can, you know, have it ready for everybody. Yeah, I saw the trailer for that, and that looks really sick. You know, even I can't. You know, I, I everything looks really good on that on that trailer. So when's that supposed to be? When's that project supposed to be? You know, completed and and be like, hey, let's ready to roll. Yeah, we still have a few more um, scenes to shoot, but I'm hoping that you know by the by the end of May that we're done with it, so I can you know at least release it you know in June or something. We just have like a lot more work to do with it, but you know I just want to make sure that. It's kind of, you know, not perfected, but, you know, it's where I want it to be. Okay, so how long have you been in the game? I've been actually doing music since I was about 19. Um, I started taking it serious at, at 19. I was always writing before that, mm -hmm. but I didn't really start, you know, getting on the mic and, you know, going to the studio until I was about 19. So, I'm you know, I'm 23 now, so it's been, so it's been quite a few years, but um, I barely started taking it serious about 19, 20. So okay. About about four years, you know, four years strong that I'm, you know, learning and doing all this stuff on my own. Okay, okay. So who gave you that chance to like, you know, just like tear it up on stage? You know, who gave you that your big chance? Um, really I kind of um kind of went from you know, from different groups. Uh I started off solo and then um, when I first started I was actually with Eyeball Entertainment with Just and Tim Z and all them. Um, then from there, we you know, we started our own company, AZG, and then, you know, I kind of just, um, decided just to be solo, you know, worked with a few different people, but the first time I actually hit the stage was with Eyeball Entertainment. Okay, okay, so how many albums have you, have you, you know, thrown down, and how many albums are you going to, you know, be coming out with? Um, like I said, I'm working on, I'm working on a solo album. Uh -huh. I'm hoping to get some nice features from some independent artists. I'm looking at, you know, Amanda Perez right now. Um, chopped it up with her, just getting her on some hooks. Um, hopefully, you know, getting some other artists that have good names behind themselves on my album that's coming out. Um, but as you know, as of now, I've already put out. I put out EPs. Um, also put out a double disc mixtape and called Shade to the Top. Um, I've just put out different mixtapes so that people can kind of you know grab onto the bait. I haven't put out an official album yet though, so it's just been mixes. Mm -hmm. Original mixes are not, you know, mixtape mixes, but it's still called a mixtape. So um, I don't really have like a, a full album yet. Okay. So what do you get your inspiration from? Like, you know, what what motivates you, or or just, you know, just just to write your music? Where do you get your motivation from, or or your inspiration from? Well, when I first started out, it was um, I started doing spoken word, and that was actually after my mother passed. So mm -hmm. I was doing a lot of spoken word, a lot of poetry. Um, and then I just, you know, started to do more, you know, you know, club songs and stuff like that. Um, right now, as as of writing, I'm really taking, you know, taking other people's stories and, and listening more, you know, than putting out my own stories. I'm listening to, you know, a lot more of, you know, how people are feeling out there and putting their stories on paper now and, you know, making them, making them our songs, you know, so it's not just about me. You know, going forward, I'm, you know, going, doing some R&B and, you know, kind of keeping it more soulful, you know, uh, more heartfelt tracks. So just heart, you know, track straight from the heart now. Okay. Now, won't you tell me about this track we're about to listen to, Feel Me? What, what, what is this all about? Where'd you get that from? Honestly, I, you know, it's, it's, it's something so I can kind of introduce myself. Um, Feel Me was, you know, it was an intro to my EP. Just basically, you know, letting everybody know, you know, I just, I just want you, you know, to feel me. I just want you to understand where I'm coming from. Kind of, you know, realize, hey, you know, I'm taking my chances. You know, um, you know, saying, you know, I lost my mom, but still, I'm gonna keep going. Um, just, you know, trying to be inspiration, you know, more inspirational, you know, on a, on a soulful track. 
I got to give a shout out to um, Captain Beats. He's the one that sent that over to me. He's out there in Texas. But, um, you know, I was just, you know, I just want you to feel me, basically. So something that, you know, listen to the lyrics and you feel me, then that's what I'm hoping, hoping to get out of it. All right, cool. All right, players. Here's your youth divine. Feel me. As I stepped into the building, I realized I was taking chances most. When we're willing, do you know what you're worth? Mama's gone into hurts, but she made it very clear. She watched us over since birth. Is this music a curse? My outlet for tragic pain. Got me mixed up with these rappers coming up in the game. Nobody's story the same. So much money to gain. My girl diamond me up, switching from basic and plain. Mindset change, working to the range, working through the veins. Feeling like I made it, I just want you to feel the same. Motivated by this money, tell me what you think. I'm just trying to rack up stuff. Back up to be left into the pain. Yeah, I just want y'all to feel me. Yeah, I just want y'all to feel me. I just want y'all to feel me. Imagine your dreams, imagine that they coming true. When it's right in front of you, tell me would you stop? Remembering the times that they try to put you down. Steady weren't shit, now they're like you high. Before I cause drama, they call me trouble. My best friend was with me, our damage was double. Let's make it together, you pick up my fumble. Keep me in place and make sure that I'm humble. Skip it. I've got a plan, who's with it? Don't talk about it, be about it, hate them, be a witness. Got more ambition than wild late. I don't care what you call me. Independent woman, handle mine, yeah, that's all me. I just want y'all to feel me. Yeah, I just want y'all to feel me. I just want y'all to feel me. Who can make you stop? Live to make a living, I ain't living like that. Yo, this is my life, man, I love to live it twice With the people that I love, I just make the same mistakes Cause we still so young Thanks to my support, yeah, I could have none Keep my deeds low and that's relation Moving ahead like a baton in a relay, huh? Stay away from all the drama and if she say, son I couldn't imagine living my life with no drive Dedication, you could put your dream on hope Lay away, I ain't waiting You see these steps that I'm taking? Now that's what you call self, come up in the making I just want y'all to feel me. Yeah, I just want y'all to feel me. I just want y'all to feel me. Yeah. Shout out to all my supporters. I couldn't do this without y'all. Unique Divine. Obvious talent. Make sure to cop the album. Coming soon. Thank you all. Yeah, I just want y'all to feel me. Damn, girl, you, you really tore it up on that track, girl. Thank you. <laughs> so, all right, so you got any upcoming shows that you're going to be doing or, or what? No, actually, I don't. I'm taking a break for shows for this whole month just so I can focus on this video and focus on um, writing and stuff, like writing for my album. Um, unless, you know, people are talking about, like, more of doing, like, paid shows and stuff like that. I'm, you know, I have I have a lot going on this this month. So, just a lot of out of town and, you know, just, um, I'm going to be in Vegas handing oh, out CDs shit. and in California just giving out CDs and stuff like that. Nice, nice. Now... So, do you still do your, the the spoken word? You know, like you mentioned earlier, you do spoke that you started out doing spoken word. Do you still do that every now and every now and then? I do actually um, perform that at Hidden House. I actually performed um, for the trailer. There's actually a spoken. There's actually a spoken word trailer. Uh -huh. So I'm I'm narrating the whole trailer. So it's, it's a spoken word piece. So that's exactly what it is. And that was just the trailer, but. Yeah, I still, you know, I do still go until when I go to, um, like, different, it just depends on the venue, you know, so, you know, some venues, like, just depending on the vibe and the mood, you know, I'll, I'll throw something in there like that. Okay, okay. So, like, where did you, where did you grow up? Did you grow up here in Phoenix, or, or, or uh, are you from out of town, or what? Nope, I'm, I'm here from Phoenix, you know, born and raised in Phoenix, so I lived in all kinds of different areas in Phoenix, so, um, my parents moved around a lot, you know, in different areas. You know, I went to high school on the west side, so, um, you know, in Avondale, so I did a lot of, a lot of different places in Phoenix, but I was, I was around not one specific place. Okay, that's cool, that's cool. So, what would you tell uh, females that are trying to get into this business? It's mainly dominated by males. 
and you know when trying to just break out in the business in general what would you tell them how would you get how would you get them started where would they go I would just say be firm, you know, stand your own ground, you know, don't let anybody, you know, you know, the differences with, with guys, they tend to not want to hear that a female is better than them. So if they're not giving you the props that, you know, you deserve, but you know that, you know, you have that potential, you have that talent, then I would just say, you know, keep going for it. You know, I, there's a lot of females that come to me and, they'll, you know, ask me for help and support. And I don't, I don't put myself on some kind of pedestal that people think I do. So right. I'm always there to kind of give them, you know, some support, give them some advice. Um, you know, they tell me to listen to their songs. I'll tell them what I think is wrong with it. You know, and, yeah. I, and then I would expect them to do the same. You know, I'm not saying I'm all the way on top, but, you know, I still listen to other people too. So I would just say, you know, stay motivated and, you know, don't even let your family or, you know, friends bring you down. If it's something that you really want to do, then right. just go for it. That's good. That's good. So. Tell me how how did you come up with the song I Love How You Doing It? How did that come about? Um, actually that was a collaboration with uh Jay Swift when um we were um uh, affiliated with uh, New Alliance West, um, Divine West U uh music. Uh -huh. And you know, we're we're still good friends, but um we we wanted to re we released that around Valentine's Day. So it was like more like a you know, a real chill, so neo soul type track. Right. Um, you know, just you know, something real smooth for the ladies and, you know, real smooth for the fellas. Right. Uh, just on that grown folk status, so. Yeah, that, when I was listening to that, you know, I was, that had a good, like, you know, army, smooth, old school kickback kind of feel to it. So, you know, yeah. I'd I, I be jamming out to that, too. <laughs> so, all right, folks, we're going to listen to Love How You Doing It with Unique Divine. So, here we go. Love how you do it. Love how you do what you do when you doing it. Mountain high, valley low, river wide. Uh, and you got me when I'm on one. Know just what I need and broke me out some. Quick to roll a L when it got done. That's why I gave you what I had. Haters got none. You run, never that. Communication never cheesy like Easy Mac. Foundation built on real spit and clever raps. Always like the rough and you never tapped. Reminisce on back how I got down. I worked the middle cow girl. Move that thing back and forth like she playing fiddle. I got more than a little cuz baby you know fluid sin. I put that on my mom. I love the way that you be doing it. Love how you do what you do when you doing it. Doing it. Doing it. Love how you do what you do when you doing it. I'm lacking, you're striking, influencing, I feel you proving things, I've never dealt with, smooth emotions, I've never felt this, baby don't you let me down, you truly bring me up, let's just cruise around this town, and smoke the sweetest kush, if you want me on the hush, I can deal with that, cause I ain't trying to bring no drama, I ain't like the baby mama, I do my own thing, so we can catch up every summer, undercover, in the covers, chemistry like we forever love us, I know it's me you love to smother, and it's all good, bless me with the realest, yeah, I knew God would, baby you're the best and you shine with me I know we feel each other deeply I can finally see Only in your arms is where I'm trying to be Love ain't blind to me You satisfy those needs Love how you do what you do when you doing it Doing it, doing it Love how you do what you do when you doing it Doing it, doing it, doing it, doing it She smiles, I smile She wants, no, she cries my desires as I place my arms around her waist, hold and squeeze into me. I want to melt into her body and discover the base of her warm, her beautiful warm body that no human mind could ever conceive. She's love, she's truth, she's real. 
As real as the stars that shine in the heavens. As real as the moon that glows and the birds that sing and the rose that That was some nice smooth R and B feel to it. I like that. That's a good track. Yes. Thank you. Uh, that's what I'm saying. For my album, I really wanna go for it um, with like more soulful, like you know, smooth smooth tracks. I think it complements my voice a lot better than, you know, trying to go harder on a track or anything. But, you know, I, I still like doing those sub tracks, so Right, right. So let me ask you this. All right. If you could go back to your very first show that you did, big prime time show, and you only had five minutes to talk to tell yourself from what's going to happen from this point on, what would you tell yourself? Definitely, you know, probably not have worked with a few people. Uh -huh. uh, you know, I mean, I'm not saying I regret working with them, but I would definitely have not done business with a few people. Um, you know, just as as from then, you know, I was I was younger. But at the same time, I mean, I can't really, I, I really, I really wouldn't want to have changed anything except just, you know, who I worked with and just building, building the right relationships and not burning any bridges because you're mad or because something didn't work out. I would just, you know, look at myself and say, don't, don't go forward and burn any bridges. If you guys aren't cool because of a specific reason, be an adult about it and just cut your ties, you know, not just don't burn any bridges. Right, right. Um, where can people find your music? Where can people get a hold of you or, you know, just in general, just listen to your music? Um, right now the best place is gonna be uh the SoundCloud slash Unique Divine and that's U N I Q U E D E V I N E. Um, I should also have my website up in a few weeks, um, uniquedivine dot com that'll have all my my videos, everything on there. And then um on YouTube it's just Unique Divine Music. So that's basically what I'm working with right now. Okay. Okay. So how long you've been working on this project that you're currently working on right now? Um, the project that I'm working on, um, as for as for the album. Right, just the album, the video. Yeah. I'm, everything. I'm getting for the video I've been working on it for almost about a month. Um well it's we worked on it a few we had a few weeks that we worked on it, but um it's been in the process for about a month. So um, Carlos is, you know, we're really putting a lot of time and effort into this. As for the album, I can't really give a specific date because I'm, I'm still writing for it. Mm -hmm. And, you know, things come up in between then. So I'm, I'm most likely going to put out another, like, EP just to kind of keep people on their toes before I drop the, the official album with, you know, all the, all the features. Okay. Okay. Now, can you tell me about this last track we're going in? How did you come up with that? And, you know, we're... It's, it's it's rock hard. It's rocking really hard. So what's up with that? You gotta tell me what the story behind that. Well, with, with the story behind that, that track is basically just you know me wanted to represent like you know all, all the ladies out there, um because you know like a lot of a lot of tracks right now is just a lot of dudes out there kind of just you know more of like representing you know for the for the flowers. So I just want right. something where you know the ladies can feel like they're going in like you know and like I said you know you're. If you're a student, if you're, you know, a teacher, or a mom, whatever, that's the that's song you want to blast and put on in your car when you're getting off of work and, you know, going to the club or, you know, what, you know, just to get, just to get, just to get your night going. So that track, actually, um, I had wrote it for the YZ, so I can perform it at the YZ show. I didn't end up performing it. Uh -huh. Um but I just wanted to take my time. I actually re-recorded that song a few different times just because I wanted to get it perfected. Uh -huh. And then um, I had um, a, a dude come in and actually do the guitar rip over it. So it was pretty Ooh. cool that he added that to it. Nice, nice. Now, what other female rappers do you see moving up the ranks like you? Um, as, far, as far as locally, um, I see a few different female artists out here doing it. Um, I see uh, Miss Explicit. I see um, Yami. Um, a few different artists. I mean, I can't really pinpoint like who I see out there really, really doing a lot of stuff like consistently. Mm -hmm. But you know, who I have respect for. You know, I have respect for all the female artists. But I really, I mean, Kia's. Um, I know Lady Air is out there doing it. I'm just not sure who's staying consistent and, and on their grind, you know what I'm saying? So, but I mean, I respect all female artists out here doing their thing. Right, right. So, we want to give out any shout outs to anybody? Uh, give a shout out to uh, Border Gang right now, uh, representing Border Gang right now. Uh, just want to give a shout out to everybody in Border Gang. Um, I mean, everybody I've done music with, 
you know, all the different producers, uh, Captain Beach, uh, you know, and everybody who's following me and all the fans. Right on, right on. Now, I got to ask you this one question. What do you what do you tell people that, that, that come across you? Oh, you don't look like a rapper. You know, you don't look like you could rock the mic. W- what do you tell them? I don't, I don't say anything. I just, I just let the music speak for itself. <laughs> <laughs> there you have it. Players, Unique Divine, represented for the ladies. All right, we're going to listen to the last track. We're going in. <laughs> Got your letters, Players, Street Life Entertainment. Don't forget to hit us up on Facebook, forward slash Street Life ENT. And youtube.com forward slash street life ENT PHX AZ. Remember, players, we do this for life. Here we go again, and we're going all in. I've been known to cause trouble, miss man, it's so damn. Didn't mean to make a scene, getting money's in my plan. Representing for my ladies who don't lean on a man. We deserve this night, almost missed my flight. Running hard weekdays, study hard weeknights, and it feels so right. Man, I earned this shit. Hot girl looks nice, let's burn this bitch on. Uh, oh, Just starting on the 